Hello and welcome to the Draft Masters series. We are here in the Gen 4 car at Talladega. Well, this week has gone pretty terribly so far for me. So, uh, you know, might as well keep up the holiday spirit and uh, continue doing things that are probably going to turn out poorly. <laughs> uh, this is my first time doing a uh, Draft Masters race, believe it or not. Not really my cup of tea usually, but hey, Rogers. we'll give it a try. It's a Gen 4 car, and I don't think I've done a super speedway race in the Gen 4 car before. I doubt it's going to be too much different from Arca, just a little bit faster, I guess. Probably a lot a bit faster, actually, but uh, I'm probably going to look pretty much the same as it usually does. Um, just go in default setup here. I doubt that's going to matter too much, but who knows? I could be wrong. It's probably going to matter a lot in qualifying, actually. So I'm probably going to regret... Actually, you know what? Can I put Q-tape on this thing? Is that a thing in the Gen 4? It is. Uh, at least, at the very least, let's do that. I'm sure I'm going to finish... Maybe I shouldn't qualify, because if I qualify, I'm still going to be in the back of those who did qualify without a queue setup. No, let's, we still want to be up as far front as possible, so we'll, we'll qualify. Sorry, being a little indecisive here, but uh, we'll qualify. Despite the fact it's not going to put us too far up. <laughs> Sorry, just remembered another thing. I uh, need to get my shifting setups, or my shifting settings correct. Gotta get that on there. There we go. Alright, last uh, <laughs> last distraction. We're back out here to do our very boring Q-Lab. Why is this chipping out at the 8000 RPM? I thought this thing was supposed to get up to the 9000 RPM. Whatever, I don't know anything. Oh, I bet you know what? It's probably like a super speedway package for this thing. Or something. That's probably what it is, right? So. We'll, uh... We'll go around one time here on the high, higher line. Get our speed up and then see uh, how well we can qualify. But without the queue set up, probably going to be in the back. Of those who did qualify. But no cautions in the Draftmaster series, so that's why I actually do want to qualify. The hope is that we'll be in front of the wreck if slash when it happens. Because if you have to check check up for it, you're pretty much done whether you get in the wreck or not. Green flag, green flag. Assuming okay. everybody in front of you is not involved. So we're going to try to be a little bit aggressive, try to get to uh, as close to the front as we can. And, uh, I don't know, probably wreck. <laughs> but, uh, Draft Master Series, you're guaranteed official super speedway racing every week. For those that like it, awesome. That's cool that this option is out there for you, because if you love super speedway racing, then you get it You get 24-7, pretty much. Not really what I'm into, but I'll, I'll run in here once in a while. Especially if I'm feeling particularly hateful of myself <laughs> and uh you know, getting a wreck or two All right, we'll actually try to uh put a lap in now means we're gonna go down to the bottom here not bothering with uh lowering my force feedback to zero or anything i don't really care all that much we'll just see what we can do let go of the steering wheel essentially on the back stretch It'll travel back down to the bottom, and then stick it around the yellow line again. Steering wheel. I wonder if we want to take the apron. Probably not in this thing, right? Probably going too fast. We will wrap the yellow line. One way here, and are we going to gain any spots from 14th? Chicken flag, not really. Chicken flag. Yeah, as I figured, not having a queue set up is going to be bad news. I think everybody here probably knows how important it is 
to qualify in front of where the wreck is going to be, so we'll probably get caught up in it. But that's all right. I already lost my A4.9 after the last race. The 87s at Phoenix had uh, someone dump me on lap two, and then uh, a huge restart wreck on lap four as we restarted, and I uh, was crawling by it, and somebody decided, while perpendicular to the track, to hit their gas while I was passing by. So that was a good old 8x in the first four laps, and there went my a499 after a really tough week so hopefully gonna get that back but probably not gonna be here we're just gonna continue digging a hole deeper but who knows I'm setting myself up for failure so that way I can uh, feel happy whenever we actually don't die you know low expectations and then when you beat them you're like all right we did it we're also the number one car, one to go. which means we'll lose a whole lot of I-rating when we do get wrecked. I clearly don't care about that, though, or else I wouldn't be here. Or in the SK Modifieds, or in the Tour Mods, or in the uh, USF 2000s. Any of those that usually either have low strength of field or I'm terrible in, or both. So, we're here to have fun. And uh, I saw the Gen 4 here, and I'm like, you know what? Sometimes, with this ARCA car body, the races aren't so bad. Because, generally, people know you're not supposed to bump draft with these. And that means you're not getting horrible, over-aggressive pushes or anything like that. And Hey, maybe everybody in here is a sh super speedway expert because they've been racing uh, Draftmasters every week. Multiple times. So maybe everyone in here is like a really good super speedway racer. That's not the most far-fetched possibility, right? Yeah, we're positive. We're having a positive outlook. We'll get uh, do we'll do session best lap because all time best. It won't log our fast laps here because of draft. So, just for fun, we'll see how fast we're going and see when we get our fastest lap. Obviously, doing session last lap or anything like that's not really helpful here. We'll be on the outside to start. I'm going to try to move my f way forward, but also just going to get a feel of what's going on around us and uh, maybe have to react accordingly. But if we can we can get some track position, that'd be great. Do I have the muted? No, I don't. The track temp just is can't hear that guy for some reason. The temp is only 18 laps. B12. Which uh, I guess only is not quite the right way to put it. 18 is pretty, pretty good here for Talladega. Well, number 12. In the outside column. I have, uh, I don't know what, like a uh, 15 minute race? Sounds about right. Catch, the 12. Car. Catch up to car number 12. Catch up and mustered up to the car number 12. I wonder what line is. I wonder what line is going to be the fast line. The guy behind us is saying to the front. We'll see. <laughs> we will see. I hope he knows that I have the default setup in, and I don't know how much that's going to matter, but I'm probably not going to be very good. Guess it's gonna be a second gear start for us. Not gonna matter too much about our jump, we're just gonna be in the draft. Maybe he's saying behind, like, hey, if you go. Oh, wait, he's not the guy behind me, he's the guy to our inside. I thought he was the guy behind us, like, saying, like, yeah, we'll draft and make it forward. But he's to the side of me, Hello. so. I don't know how he plans to <laughs> work together. Hi. Hey, uh, Steven, uh, remember that there's a wall on the right, right side now. of the uh, back straight, but... Oh, shoot, there is? Okay, I gotta watch out for that. There's a wall on the right side uh, uh -oh. of the back stretch. Okay, I'm glad he said something, because I wasn't sure. I thought we had, like, a learner situation going on here. 
Now that would be interesting, a super speedway with no wall. I think they used to do that, essentially, in real, in real life. Because you didn't have a catch fence around the corners. Yeah, the cars just sometimes flew off into the next county. The, harder the, the good old days. Ease into it and push it all the way. Alright, I guess we're doing that racing thing now. Still there, hold your line. Stay high the car on the low side. Nope, big checkup. Just what I wanted to see out of the line I'm in. Keep high. Just what I was hoping Clear. to see. Inside. Still there at the bottom. Sorry, I get very sarcastic when I Keep super speedway high. race. It's a condition. Do we want to go to the inside? I think the inside's gonna check up now. Will our prediction come true? I feel like that uh, seven car up there, he's gonna be able to get a good run and then maybe we'll move forward. Four's going middle. Car inside. Still there, hold your line. Alright, well, Keep high. this is already Three dicey. Middle. Three wide. Pick Still a lane, there. seven. Hold your line. Alright, four's Still going there. outside. Still I think there. I'll stick here. Car outside. Still Middle. Wide. Still there. Outside, two wide. Clear down low. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. On the Seems like we got some momentum Still down there. here for now. Probably just boxing myself in though. Still there. Still there. Do a little bit of a lift. Outside. Too wide. Moving a little bit up there. Still there. Stay 19 is wiggly. He's wiggling more than the wiggles. Wacky wavy and swivel tube man in front of us. Three wide. Wouldn't Hold expect anything less. Hold your line. Check up here in a second. Gotta watch out for that. Outside. Two wide. Still there. Hold your line. You're on the bottom. Three wide. Still there. We've gotten a little bit of track position, but not too much. Still there. Car in front is check up. Hold your line. Outside, you think the floor just messages everybody to the front at the start of the race to try to get everybody to work with him? Is that the uh, Draftmaster meta? Make a bunch of friends so that way they help push you in the race. We're not going much of anywhere right now though. Kind of just boxed up Still down in. here at the bottom. I feel like this is probably the best place to be if there's a wreck, though. We might be able to escape to the apron if something happens. Like the 19 in. hitting the apron. I guess I can't escape to the apron if the guy in front of us is hitting the apron and going on it. And that's the problem. Keep low. Clear up top. Oh, this bottom line is pretty darn stacked. Oh my god, what are we doing? They are wrecking behind us. Well, thank goodness we're not in that. We are suddenly at the back of the lead pack. Wait all the break, nine. Alright, so I'm gonna back off a little bit here, try to get a big run and see if I can slingshot. Now that I am afforded that opportunity. We're gonna get this top draft here. I'm gonna cut down. See how big of a run we can get in this car. Like I said, first time in the Gen 4 on a super speedway, so we'll see how much of a run we can really get. Car inside. Still inside. I'm going to go with it though, it looks like the outside lane. Just kind of got stuck. Not really anywhere to go. Uh, three's blocking. That's great. 
sure that'll end up well. Oh my god, we almost got hooked. I don't know what that guy behind us was doing. We're left out to dry here on the outside, but that's okay. Even if we fall back, it's whatever. Well, it's looking like the bottom's the place to be. Big lift here. Entering the corner. I just remembered this as official racing, which scares me. Oh, hit the freaking apron while I'm looking to the right. Alright, we're gonna go to this middle lane. I think it's got some good momentum right now. We're going over 200. At least we're actually going fast. It's kind of supposed to be the spectacle of super speedway racing, right? And then half the time we don't even go fast in the cars we bring here. But at least we got that going for us. Okay, that was a car in my in my eyesight that I didn't really want to see in my eyesight. Guy on the bottom coming up a little bit more than I would have liked. Got more numbers on the bottom. Oh, that 18 scared me, man. They got more numbers on the bottom, so they're generally going faster. Even if they are stacking each other up just a little bit. Big run for the second lane here. I don't know where the 10's going, but he wanted to do a third lane, I guess. Oh, good. Lap cars. I'm sure they're going to sit on the bottom, aren't they? That's what they love to do. So it's like, it looks like that's what they're prepared to do. Do we, are they seriously... How does how do people not learn this? Is it not common sense that you got two wide cars go up coming behind you? You don't go high. Okay, there they go. She is, man. All right, let's get by him safely. In the middle, three wide. In the mail for you all. Kind of liking the, the energy we have in the second lane. We get a lot of good runs out of the corners. Feels like we've got it pretty well held together here. The tin slips up a little bit sometimes, but for the most part, we're feeling pretty good out here, I think. I mean, can you guys not? What do we not? We got lap cars in the mix. Still there, inside. That might be what's happening back there. Clear inside. Have to assume this lap car is gonna go high, right? He's not gonna stay in the middle. Hope so. Looks inside. like he is. He's good. Keep high. You're in the middle. Three wide. Clear outside. Two wide. Stay high. Why, why do we gotta do this with the lapis? I don't understand. You gotta be kidding me. Is this guy seriously staying on the bottom? Yeah, I have no idea. Stay high. Oh my god. Ten. You're up top. Three wide. Right side. Two wide. Clear Is it not common sense for a lap car to go high when two by two is coming up on you? Car inside. Thanks, 
Nah, he's gonna be a dickhead. Gotta get to 17. Hey, looky, I'm the outside, outside line now. Right. The next car's the leader. Inside, two wide. Still inside. You're in second position right now. Clear. All right. You're in the lead. Car Are we going to start getting bump drafts? Clear. And a car that does not like it. I better get up on the wheel and make sure that uh, we can handle it if it happens. Blockers are about to make it three wide here. Watch. Inside. Stay high. Yeah, we're getting bump drafted in the corner in an arca body. That is rad. Fortunately, we're not getting too much speed. Yeah, we're, we're, okay, we're okay, we're okay. Inside. Okay. I might go down to the bottom just because I'm a little scared about the guy that's pushing me. Although I do like the fact that we're uh, out of the corner, doing really well. I think we'll stick here, just hope we don't die. what the fuck are you doing? Inside. Oh my god. They made me back behind. That's why I was worried about that guy. Well, there goes our pusher. That sucks. And I'm being abandoned. Sweet. Yeah. I've been abandoned. Oh! We've got a new friend. And it's a black number three. That's good luck, right? I wasn't listening to you, but I am now. Alright, the two's yeah, not gonna be a friend, he's gonna be a foe. And go to the outside. Bro, you know what you're doing. Like, chill out. Who the fuck are you talking to, bro? I'm not even near you. The next car's the You were just blocking the top lane for me for about two laps, but alright. I'm getting and a good push here. I'm about to block the top again. Bro, you got the wrong guy. I don't know what you're talking about. You've been inside me this entire time. Oh my god. Oh, look at that. Number four takes you out. Eat that, bitch. Thanks for that. This is why I wanted to be as close far up as I could be. Eleven, you were blocking the outside while being a lap down. Alright, pull on the parachute. What you were doing wrong. Still hold. Clear inside. I was not doing that, you fucking idiot. Reevaluating my life. Now nah, he's got the right one. There's few enough guys up here now that I'm kind of okay. I don't have the wrong card, but all right, hanging out, uh, hanging out back. Maybe working hey, with the two for a big run later. Nope, he's gonna go around me. All right, he's not interested in getting a big run. You know what? He can go first then. That's fine. Ah, thanks for avoiding the question. So no, you're not on the lead lap, and you were running with the group pack, blocking the outside lane, so I couldn't get outside. Yo, you're Man, on the lead lap. off is dangerous. We lost a lot of space lane. there. Shut the fuck up. I was in the back of the pack, hanging back here. Oh my god, they are everybody. arguing. I am not interested in hearing about that. It's super speedway racing. We're doing draft masters. <laughs> Still, just gotta remember that. And there they go. How did they survive that? You just got the white flag. That means one more lap to go. All right, here comes the alley -oop. Outside, outside is clear. White flag, white Car flag. inside. Still there. Still there. Still there. Go to Clear. go. I believe in you. Inside. Team America. Still there. Still there. Ooh, I thought they were wrecking. Running into each other for some reason. 
Not enough energy in the second lane, unfortunately, but we'll finish decent. Get me the heck out of here. P4. Hey, I'll take it. We survived, too. A lot of people didn't. Oh my god, the team tried to kill me. Can we turn this on now? Alright. That slap was our fastest. That's neat. You're right, but... We'll do the good race, good win. Hey, we got a top five, top four, I guess. Let's get this thing parked. Drove around the track one more time because <laughs> everyone's kind of scared me. With their uh, cooling down lap kind of going over. <laughs> All right. 15, you're literally a fucking idiot, bro. Oh, we've learned that he is literally an idiot. All right. So 12th to 4th. I'll definitely take that um, with my default setup as well. Still don't know if that matters too much, but I don't know why I'm looking at my tires, although that is more than I expected to see. 97, 98. But uh, all right. We'll see what uh, the causes of the wrecks were. Here we go. This is why people like super speedways, right? The big old big ones. Big old. What the heck was that? Where is the eight going? Meow. <laughs> Runs all the way down into him. Clobbered him, too. It's like he just didn't see him at all. Maybe he was in a blind spot and uh, he forgot that his sputter said Carlo or something. 11's too far down the track for three wide, looks like. Yeah, they're three wide, and uh, the 11's kind of coming down into the 12. Maybe a little bit of net code, though, too. Yeah, it looks like maybe that helped out a little bit, although the 11 was too low, I think. And then we, thankfully, just barely are able to avoid being in that. It's a good thing we're on that bottom line. You can see here, they get turned out there and start piling up. Just avoid as the 7 comes down and collects everybody else behind us. Oh, Aww. 13 gets hooked. That was net code too. Oops. So that was that first wreck. Got another one, I think, that happens here soon. 18 clears himself, and that somehow does not cause a wreck. Yeah, the 18 was not clear, and he comes down into the 14. That could have easily been a wreck. Uh-oh, we got one happening here, though. Oh yeah, this is when our help went away. The 10 just uh, runs into the back of him in the middle of the corner, even though he's not supposed to be the guy pushing. And uh, unfortunately, the 19 gets the bad end of it. So that wasn't even his fault. Or her fault. I don't know. Uh, let's see. Yeah, 18 goes too far low, looks like. I mean, the 4 was a little high, I guess. But, I mean, if you're going by, like, the lanes on the track, I guess. I don't know. It does kind of look like maybe the 4 should have been a little bit lower, but then again, the 18... Yeah, they, they both kind of meet in the middle a little bit. I think the 18 probably should have been higher up, though, more more than anything. So they get together there. Somehow almost save it, but unfortunately they get kind of hooked up on the bottom here. And a couple more people get knocked out of it. Are they still arguing? That really stinks for those guys. Got guy. Oh. What is that? Is this guy seriously trying to cause a wreck? When the these guys are coming? That's bad, man. Why would you do this, Steven? I believed in you. I don't know who this guy is, but. That is ugly.
That's like uh, Kevin LePage if Kevin LePage were an actual demon. Like, why? Why would you do that? This is an official series. Believe it or not. There's no way that wasn't intentional either. I can't think of any possible justification for that. So that's pretty ugly. He's continuing to sit in the in the racing line way off pace too. We come up on this guy again? Oh. That's uh we got P9 and Co. coming along. Doing some bump drafting that is probably ill-advised. Running into each other and wrecking. And then what do we got here? Not sure, the 18 way off pace. Is this this maybe this is the race is the over? Yeah, I think the race is actually over at this point. So that was it. I didn't really see what those guys were yelling about, just the lap cars racing. Uh, with the lead pack, maybe being frustrating. Can we turn that on now? And I wasn't blocking anyone either. Who was the 11? Uh, he was the guy that early on went a little bit too far low, I think. Yeah. And then I guess he was racing the guys later. Yep, so that's that, I guess. He just rejoins the race later. Yeah, here it is. Laps down and just kind of being frustrating, I guess. The 12 as well, maybe. But uh, that will do it for us. We'll check out the race results page. I actually don't know if I gained or lost uh, anything here. I should have gained safety rating. <laughs> Crazy, I know. But I think I might have gained a tiny bit of uh, I rating too. We'll see here. Plus 9 and plus 0 0.04 in the safety rating department. So that went actually pretty well. See, I set my expectations low. And uh, when things turned out nice, it feels even better. And look, I let a lap. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I got you, man. Look, Ma, I did it. So 28, 15 strength of field, 5 splits. And, uh, that'll do it. Better than expected. Gotta love it. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed something a little bit different from what I normally do. And, uh, I'll see you in the next one. Have a good one.